Understanding test policies, to retake or not. Hello, dear learners. Today, we will dive deep into understanding the test policies of the SAT and ACT, specifically focusing on what you need to know if you're considering retaking either of these exams. Knowing these policies can be crucial in making an informed decision. First and foremost, understanding test policies can save you a lot of time, money, and stress. It gives you clarity on how often you can take the tests, the costs involved in retaking, any potential impacts on your score reports. Without this knowledge, you might find yourself in unexpected situations or even miss opportunities to improve your scores. When it comes to the SAT, retaking is allowed. College Board allows you to take the SAT as many times as you want. However, you must register and pay for each attempt. Score Choice This feature allows you to choose which SAT scores you want to send to colleges. If you think you can perform better, you can take the SAT again and later decide which score to share. Fee Waivers for eligible students, College Board offers fee waivers. This means you might not have to pay to retake the SAT if you qualify. Switching gears to the ACT. Test limits. You can take the ACT up to 12 times. But remember, each retake comes with a cost. Super scoring. Some colleges, super score, the ACT, meaning they take the best section scores from multiple test dates and average them. This can be beneficial if you excel in different sections on different test days. Fee waivers, like the SAT, the ACT also offers fee waivers for eligible students, potentially covering your registration costs. Before you decide to retake the SAT or ACT, Ponder over these points. Is it necessary? If your scores are already in the range of the colleges you're aiming for, retaking might not be necessary. Preparation. Ensure you have enough time and resources to prepare better for the next attempt. Time. Remember that college applications have deadlines. Make sure you have enough time to receive your scores and submit them before these deadlines. In essence, while both the SAT and ACT offer flexibility in retaking the tests, it's imperative to understand their respective policies. We hope this video gave you clarity on the subject. Remember, every student's journey is unique. So make informed decisions that align best with your academic goals. Until next time, happy learning!